The 2015 Ludiana CMC Alumni Reunion was held in Cleveland, Ohio at the Downtown Weston Hotel in August. Coming from across the country, CMC graduates, spouses, and in some cases children started visiting and catching up with each other as soon as they met. For some, it was their first time to attend an alumni reunion. Others had hardly missed one since the first one held in 1982. That first evening after hors d'oeuvres, Dr. Krishnan Chandar greeted everyone and went over the activities planned for the weekend. Free time was scheduled for Saturday morning. Some enjoyed the botanical gardens. Some checked out the lakefront just a few blocks away. Others visited the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame and became instant celebrities and still others visited the intriguing Science Center, which was in walking distance. After lunch that first day, Dr. Indrajit Gill gave a lecture on the aortic and mitral valve, followed by a time of questions and answers. In the evening, buses transported everyone to one of the day's main attractions, a dinner cruise on the Nautica Queen. Once the ship got underway, dinner was served, and visiting continued as the sun set on the Lake Erie horizon. Later, with some dancing on the second deck, others visited on top deck as they watched the city lights pass by. Saturday was the day to get down to business. It was packed with activities. During the morning continuing medical education time, five lectures were presented on the latest medical practices and research by experts in their fields of medicine. Dr. Manakshi Singh from CMC Batch 1975 shared research on biomarkers of endometrial cancer. Dr. Singh is Vice President of the Alumni Association and also serves on the CMC US Board. Dr. Ashok Antony, Batch of 1969, presented findings about anemia in resource-limited settings in his lecture entitled, Mothers and Babies, Walking the Razor's Edge. Dr. Samita Jarge's lecture dealt with the management of chronic constipation. Dr. Piyadi Lal Ogra, batch of 1956 and member of the CMC US Board, presented a lecture on gut feeling in which he dealt with immunity and bacteria in the history of human development. Dr. Avindra Nath, batch of 1976, presented his lecture on challenges in diagnosis and management of neuroinflammatory diseases. The CMC lectures were presented to a full house and comments were heard widely that it was one of the best they had attended. Following lunch, the annual business meeting was definitely the most animated time of the weekend. The meeting, led by President Dr. Arun Adhlaka, received the minutes of the 2014 meeting, which was held in Los Angeles, and received the treasurer's report from Dr. Swaranjit Singh. Amidst the discussion about finances and where to hold the next reunion, Votes were taken and decisions were made. Max Marble, Executive Director of the Ludiana CMC Board USA, prepared a map showing where everyone lived and served. He also shared information about the 2015 project of providing 10 new anesthesia machines and cardiac monitors for CMC. The meeting closed with a time of remembering and celebrating the lives of those who had passed on since last year's meeting held in Los Angeles. Among those remembered were CMC graduates as well as members of the CMC faculty. A bell tolled after each name was read. That evening, everyone dressed up for the closing gala event. Dr. Chandar, who organized the event, thanked everyone for attending. 
Dr. Adhlakka, president, served as MC for the evening. Reverend Doug Virgin, who was born in Brown Hospital, shared experiences and pictures of growing up on the CMC campus. His parents, Dr. and Mrs. Virgin, served at CMC from 1949 to 1960. Dr. Subhas Singla, CMC alumni president, came all the way from Ludhiana to bring greetings from Dr. Thomas and the institution. Dr. Rani Sidhu showed pictures of what it was like way back in the early and mid-40s. Her mother, Dr. Balwant Sidhu, graduated in 1946 and was one of Dr. Edith Brown's students. <laughs> pictures of the March ribbon-cutting dedication for the new labor rooms and nurseries at CMC were shown by Max Marble. Following a delicious meal, entertainment included songs by Dr. Newton Gill, Dr. Rani Sidhu, and Dr. Vipin Mithal. And then the dancing took the gathering into the night. All too soon, it was time to pack and head for home. People left remarking about what a good time they had had as they started looking forward to next year in Denver. Thank you.